Hello, thank you for joining me today. We're reading through A Course in Miracles, The Daily Lessons, and today we're on Lesson 287. You are my goal, my Father, only you. Where would I go but heaven? What could be a substitute for happiness? What gift could I prefer before the peace of God? What treasure would I seek and find and keep that can compare with my identity? And would I rather live from fear than love? You are my goal, my father. What but you could I desire to have? What way but that which leads to you could I desire to walk? And what except the memory of you could signify me to the end of dreams and futile substitutions for the truth? You are my only goal. Your son would be as you created him. What way but this could I expect to recognize myself and be at one with my identity? I'll read it again. You are my goal, my father, only you. Where would I go but heaven? What could be a substitute for happiness? What gift could I prefer before the peace of God? What treasure would I seek and find and keep that can compare with my identity? And would I rather live with fear than love? You are my goal, my father. What but you could I desire to have? What way but that which leads to you could I desire to walk? And what except the memory of you could signify to me the end of dreams and futile substitutions for truth? You are my only goal. Your son would be as you created him. What way but this could I expect to recognize myself? and be at one with my identity. I'm really enjoying these lessons as we get closer and closer to the end because we're really getting to the heart of things now, right? And I think about these things every day as we look at the world around us and what's happening. If each person could just know who and what they are and, and what this all means in, in a very personal way, the world would be so different. We could do it overnight if there was some way to just educate everybody at once. So those are my dreams somehow that by us doing this work, we're putting it out in the field and making it more accessible to others and that others will find their way here. We are each divinity in form. We are each God's son, if you will. I hate the patriarchal language, but uh, sometimes it just is the way it is with this text in particular. But we are each God's thought in form here and if we would come to that and know that we would be so different all of us it would be so beautiful well we'll close with that today if you would like additional support or conversation about this uh, 907-351-3003. It's best to text to that number at least to start with. Um, or you can message me on Facebook or YouTube or SoundCloud or through my websites, lindalamp.com, lindalamp.shop. Until tomorrow, namaste and much love. <laughs>